So, baking powder. Baking powder. So it what must do I do be, with this? You just sprinkle it around on in the inside. Is that yep, good? that's fantastic. Just like that. Just like that. You're good at this. Anybody think you were a chef? <laughs> in Christmas 2006, I ended up in hospital. And they did the MRI scans and found the lesion on my brain stem. What that meant for me was that I couldn't go home because I needed instant attention. Fantastic. Well, it looks rough and ready, a bit like me. That would be me too. So prepare your, your cake tin like <laughs> so. <laughs> like so. I used to stop breathing without notice any time, day or night. My brain would switch off from being one day not too sick at all to the next day being told I couldn't go home. And it was like my whole life changed in, in sort of 15 minutes. So it's jam-packed full of fruit, isn't it? It is. The only place that um, nursing homes could put me where I could get that sort of attention was a dementia ward. The average lifespan in a nursing home is two to three years. Wow. So as a young person, you're living with people who are dying. I was in a facility that was um, awful. It was just horrid. I was sharing two and a half bathrooms and three toilets with 10 other people. If I, if I didn't have young care, um, I, it would be awful. What I get from young care is I'm living in a place where we are encouraged to expand, mm. to be real people. Mm. I've got my own bedroom, my own bathroom, my own balcony, they would take me out. I was given the opportunity to be me. So tell me about this recipe, Roman. I mean, it's, oh. a, it's a strange recipe. We've always had a blonde Christmas cake and it started because I think my great-grandmother didn't like the stodgy traditional, pudding, traditional yeah. Christmas cake. So they came up with this blonde Christmas cake recipe. I've never seen a cake with curry powder in it in my life. And I might start putting some in my cakes, some of my cakes at work. There's something about sugar and butter together. Oh, I know. Uh, Who gets to lick the bowl afterwards? Me. Oh, people see you as the person in the wheelchair. But Young Care is trying to change that perception. I think by sharing this cake, I'm sharing a part of my life. So. People out there will realise that people with disabilities are real people. Yeah, yeah. It's going to be a really, really tasty Christmas cake. But also, all the funds are going to go to one of the most amazing causes. We'll give at least another 5, 10, 20, 100 people the opportunity to uh, live an active, fulfilled life. Oh, look at that. That is a winner. Mm. <laughs>